Anthony Weiner resisted calls to withdraw from the New York City mayoral race Tuesday after finding himself caught in another sexting scandal similar to the one that ended his congressional career two years ago. Weiner admitted sending a woman sexually explicit photos and messages and acknowledged the activity took place as recently as last summer, more than a year after he resigned from the House in June 2011 for the same sort of behavior with at least a half dozen women. With his wife, Huma Obedin, Standing an arm's length away from him, Weiner told a hastily called news conference he would stay in the race despite the new onslaught of negative publicity. I want to bring my vision to the people of the city of New York. I hope they are willing to still continue to give me a second chance, Weiner said. In an editorial posted online Tuesday, the New York Times urged Weiner to drop out of the race, saying Weiner should take his marital troubles and personal compulsions out of the public eye away from cameras, off the web and out of the race for mayor of New York City. Three of his rivals for mayor public advocate Bill de Blasio and former city councilman Sal Albanese, both Democrats, and billionaire John Katsimatidis, a Republican also called on Wiener to quit the race. Enough is enough, de Blasio said. The sideshows of this election have gotten in the way of the debate we should be having about the future of the city. Another mayoral hopeful, City Controller John Liu, stopped short of calling for Wiener to bow out, but suggested his propensity for pornographic selfies is a valid issue for voters. The other leading Democratic candidates, including City Council Speaker Christine Quinn and former City Controller Bill Thompson, did not immediately comment. The congressman fessed up to the naughty texts after sexually explicit photos and online chats between Carlos Danger, allegedly the pseudonym for the City Hall hopeful, and an unidentified woman surfaced on the blog, thedirty.com. The reports claim that that the conversation between the Paul and an unidentified 23-year-old woman took place on the social media website Formspring in August 2012, a year after he resigned from his post in Congress after being caught the first time, and nearly seven months after his first child with wife Obedine was born. The woman claims on the blog that she first started talking online with Wiener in July 2012 and it became intense by August 2012, when he offered to find a Chicago condo where they could meet up. She also alleges that they had phone sex and that they exchanged nude photos of each other. She claims she received photos from Wiener of his penis sent from a Yahoo email account under the Carlos Danger name. The purported image was later posted on the dirty.com. Wiener released a written statement on Tuesday afternoon, which he read again at the press conference, admitting to additional raunchy conversations. I said that other texts and photos were likely to come out, and today they have, he said in the statement, referring to comments he made two months ago during the start of his mayoral campaign. As I have said in the past, these things that I did were wrong and hurtful to my wife and caused us to go through challenges in our marriage that extended past my resignation from Congress. While some things that have been posted today are true and some are not, there is no question that what I did was wrong. This behavior is behind me. Wiener did not elaborate on which of the new reports are true or false and whether or not it took place last summer. It's unclear how the lewd news will impact Wiener's campaign. Some New Yorkers have shown a willingness to forgive his past indiscretions since he announced his mayoral campaign via YouTube in May. He has since shot to the lead in the polls, with a Quinnipiac University survey last week showing he held 25% of the vote. Officials from Anthony Weiner's mayoral campaign did not respond to requests for additional comment.